Hi everyone, this is Waves, and I'm going to show you how to get set up with the next action guide. So the first thing you need to do is create a Patreon if you don't already have one. If you do have one, go over to patreon.com and you can search for Fonzas under the creators. His will be this ebb and hold page. Once you've created that and you've gone over to his page, the lowest amount of support you need to give is just $2 a month in order to get access to his next action guide. You can go to join, and then it's going to ask you to input your payment information. Now, once you have subscribed, you then need to connect your Discord up to Patreon. To do that, go to membership, and you'll see this quick link for Discord community. Click on connect to Discord. This is then going to ask for your authorization. And then you can go click on open server and you should then see ebb and hold and be able to see this Sims and next action guide. So under that, if you click on next action guide access, you'll then be able to see all of the different passwords and instructions. So now what you need to do is go to the Weak Aura's website and it's going to ask you to input a password. That password is found in Discord. I've now inputted the password. This will allow me to decrypt it and now I can copy the import string. This is what I'm going to copy and then put into Weak Aura's. Once I have that weak Aura import stream, then I have to do one more thing on Discord, and that's install this add-on. So I first need to download it. And then once it's downloaded, I then need to install it. Okay, now that you have downloaded this add-on, we have to install it in the add-ons folder. So. First thing we're going to do is go to the add-ons folder. You can find that in, if you're on a Windows PC, local disk, usually in your World of Warcraft folder, which is found usually in program files x86. In my case, I have multiple versions. Mine is classic. Now, if you're confused which version you should be using, one way to remedy that or to figure out which one is to go into CurseForge and see where it is installing your add-ons for Cataclysm. And you'll know that that's the one you want to use, the folder you want to use. So I'm going to click on Classic. I'm going to go to Interface, Add-ons. These are all of my add-ons that I currently have installed. I then want to open up Fonza's DB. And that's the thing that I want to install and move over to add-ons. Now that that is installed and we have our import string, we can then test out the next action guide. Okay, now I'm in game and I'm going to open up Weakaras. I'm going to import that string that I got from the Weakaras site that I had to input that password for. And then click import. And now that I have the weak aura added in, I'm just going to put it right up in front of me. And then inside the custom options is where I can change a couple of different things like force master frost rotation or turn it off. I can mess with my minimum hit, my disease drop tolerance, my minimum expertise, raise dead on trash, hide when out of combat, blood tap for frenzy, and whatnot. In this case, it's telling me just to get into unholy. Uh, right now, I am in the oblit set, so I'd want to go back and actually not force the master frost rotation. And you can see a couple of things. This is Army, Howling Blast. It's wanting me to do Pillar of Frost. 
and my raised dad. As I get started, you'll notice as well on the right here that there is a snapshotter, just like you see over here. This is telling me that I will increase my DPS if I snapshot my outbreak, like that. You can also see underneath the timers for my diseases and how when I do Howling Blast, it refreshes that number. You can also see a, a Blit counter. And now it's telling me that I should do my Raise Dead. Now you might be asking yourself, why is Waves using the Oblit spec instead of Master Frost? Well, it's because I'm main unholy and I didn't want to completely reforge for this video. So, sue me. But that's how you get started with the next action guide.